how's it going? Shaw Tire here, back with some more Rome Total Realism Imperium Serectum Let's Play Zeperus. Now previously uh, we managed to capture Eritrea and um, off camera I've done some minor micromanagement, wasn't really much to talk about. Um, I brought a unit out of Orchimenes down to Tanagra here. Uh, this unit of a Contestai. Uh, the idea was that I could take uh, Alexander's army out and we could go and attack this um, Athenian army here before they uh, come after us, which I'm pretty sure they're going to uh, sooner rather than later, uh, now that they're uh, allies with the Antigonids. But uh, as you can see, we haven't quite got enough movement. So I'll leave that till later. Um, I also put a couple of units of uh, a Contestai into the recruitment queue uh, for garrison duty so we can bring these three units down uh, to join up with Atalos and his, his army, reinforce it, and then we can go after uh, Megalopolis and Sparta. Which you can see I've got reasonable forces, the Antigonids have got about half a stack in there and the Spartans have got about three quarters of a stack. Uh, they do have another settlement down here but I don't really imagine they've got a great um, a great military left. Uh, just, just give a quick look, where's Athens? Military. Now they're pretty low. We're, we're way ahead of them. So yeah, we take out this uh, settlement here and uh, they'll be pretty much done. Um, same goes for Antigonus. We've got a decent garrison in here. Well, it's only four units actually. Uh, so it's not enough a lot left. So hopefully I should be able to see out uh, this campaign to reach its target and um, yeah always good right then um, what else have I got? I've got this depleted unit of uh, Thuriophoroi come down in Aegon and we'll get them re retrained and replenished um, we've got a decent garrison up here in Foynike uh, should the Ardui get um, brave and come in uh, attackers up there along the Adriatic coast. Right then, well it's more like the Ionian Sea here actually isn't it? Um, up here in the north in Macedonia um, I've got a, a unit or two in most of these settlements. I'm recruiting a unit of Hippocontestai and Pella and what I'll probably do is uh, pull all of them out of the settlements and just make up a small roaming field army um, maybe recruit another unit or two and to give us up somewhere near half a stack just to take care of any uh, rebels that decide to come and raid I don't think we have to worry too much about any main factions like the Seleucids here uh, as far as I know they've only got this one settlement there's only a couple of units in there. Can't see anything else over here yet. Let's just send my spy around to check it out for me. The Adrissians, well, they don't look particularly strong, although they do look as if they increase, they've increased their numbers a little bit. But I think they'll have enough to contend with themselves up in, the, in and around their region, so we don't have to really worry about them too much. Right then, so my next move is to bring out um, Sel of course and the bulk of his army and uh, we'll go over and besiege Calchas and we'll look to take that after the end turn. Let's put up the three ladders. Um, yeah, I'm making, against a strong enough army, make sure we take that settlement. Uh, we haven't really got much in there. Two unknown units we can see. One most likely a governor. 
um, about three quarters of a unit of hot lattes and these other four units are really badly depleted um, I mean it's three Javcav units there but there's nothing of note to worry about again this unknown unit type I think that's more than likely to be maybe a maybe a full unit of Greek hot lattes but um, yeah that's about it so I don't think that'll be too difficult to take but we shall see after the end term so let's go there Looks like an Athenian spy, or maybe they're going to attack us. Oh, there they are. Well, it's a bit quicker than I thought it would be. Uh, I didn't think they'd go after Corinth, actually. I thought they more likely to head north to Orchomenus. That's, that's a bit weaker. It's our friendly little Arduin spy for the umpteenth time going into Phoenike. See you, girlfriend. Right then. So first things first, let's uh, get this depleted unit over into Aegeon and we'll have them retrained and I think we'll recruit a unit of archers there from our, yeah, archers from more garrison duty. Uh, what have we got in here? Well, here we go. Let's have this unit of um, Thurio for all in as well. Get them, well, we can't get them retrained and get any money. All right, not to worry. Uh, we'll bring these guys, these units here, down to Messene. Uh, oh, most of that Spartan army's come out of uh, Sparta now. I wonder if they get any intentions of attacking us. I mean, they're allies of Antigonus as well. I doubt it, I mean, I think we're too strong in there, but you never know with the AI and it's pretty dumb as we all know. Uh, right, well, let's get a couple of units down, these uh, Hotlites and Archers into Olympia. Right, get public under control there. Uh, now, a quick look through the news. Confirmation that Athens have declared war on us. Um, still doesn't tell us an awful lot what sort of army they are, we can't see what sort of experience and upgrades we've got, but they do have two generals, so it might be an idea to uh, bring some cavalry over with uh, Alexander's army, yep yeah, they've got enough movement, maybe bring these jar cows. Oh, we can't, we oh, can't bring them out of there until we take Calchas. All right, well, we've got four units in Corinth. They might be able to hold out against them. Although, I think we will ultimately lose in the end. I think maybe just overwhelm us with numbers. Uh, it looks as if they get a fair amount of um, sort of skirmish units as well there well at least a couple i would think uh all right then um we've got here faction announcements couple of new family members a couple of retinue expansions for parmenian and hermes and then uh, the rest is just recruitment construction uh, don't need to take any notes of that we'll get on with the battle i think and go ahead and um assault uh, right then, let's have a closer look. Yeah, yeah, it's almost a full unit of Greek hot Uh Demetrius the Cunning is a faction leader, that's a bonus. And as you can see, they've got varying degrees of um, experience and um, upgrades. There'll be a bit of resistance there, but my priority will be as usual is to uh, take as little casualties as possible. Uh, hopefully this unit of Greek Hoplites, or either of them, won't be up on the walls uh, because they do seem to get a defend, uh, an extra defence bonus when they're up there, much harder to break down and uh, you do take a lot more casualties but we just need to take it as it is. Let's go and see what we can do. Travel be 
Alright, we don't need uh, that rain. Let's see if we can change that. That's much better. Don't need your speech here. That's a nonsense speech, that one anyway. Uh, now then, the town square is straight ahead. Um, so we've got two avenues of approach to attack them. So we can sort of sandwich them in between. Although what I might do is, let's see, hold on. Yeah, our movement border only reaches there. So it should be able to go all the way around here, which it does. Um, right then. So what we'll do is, we'll put ladders here. We'll find the widest gap between towers. Try and keep casualties down that way as well. Uh, let's just uh, put all these in guard mode. I'll send these um, slingers down there as well. We'll take more fire at will for now. Um, let me see. Put another ladder. Right, this is quite a big gap as well. Same as that one down there. So I'll put another ladder there. Um, and then we'll put another one over here, I think. Yeah, I'll put a, another one here, like so. I think I'll bring the Thuriophoroi up here, actually. Like that. And the second unit of Slingers as well. And then we can attack, actually, from this gateway here into the square, as well as that gateway straight up towards the town centre there, town square there. Right, I think that looks okay. Uh, let's go and set these guys up. So, set sell of course down beside them. There we go. And we'll get a battle started. And we'll, let's see if we've got anybody up in the wall. Well, there's nobody down this end, I don't think. No. So, send you in there. Uh, no, I'll send you to that side because his shields are on that side. Take more damage from that tower. I'll bring these guys down here, I think. And then, what have we got up in the walls here? Nobody. Oh, over here. Hold on, what's this? Oh, that badly depleted unit of the Riofaroi. Um Right then, let's send this ladder up there. That should distract them, um, and if it doesn't, then we'll just attack them um, with that unit of hot potatoes. Okay. Speed things up just a little bit. Uh, what we will do is take out this corner tower here in case it's able to shoot anyway in fact go right down here and take out that tower as well oh no i tell you what we'll, we'll send these slingers down there and we'll send you up here instead Right then, up the top. Oh, they've came round, look, they quickly get you up there. And then while you're doing that, we'll send uh, the Riofuroi down here, take out these towers. The ladders are in place and our men are now attacking. Against courage, what's use our walls? And the slingers will bring you up there. Get in there quickly, boys. Bring you up here. Get you 
up my top there. Put you on fire at will. Send you down there. Who's that? Unit there. Eight hopper chains. And that's uh, almost full unit. So we shoot the shit out of them, be good. Back up here. I think we've finished them off, have we? That's pretty good. Now then, anyone about? Where is everybody? There's a general. Where are they down to? Hundred and four, I don't really kill that many of them. Now then I think what we'll do is we'll uh, we'll bring all our hot waters down here. Who's that? Oh three off really cavalry. Let's bring you down to here. Should start shooting at those three off I really wait them out. There we go, dummy eye again, just sitting there and taking it on the chin. Which is good. Right then, now then. Get you guys there. And we'll bring you whoops. three units in here and our general of course now they're going to draw them away from the square that's the thing The Contest Titan with two in that unit, Prodromo is only four in that unit. What's happening with these? Um, where did they go? Oh, there they are. Down to 97. It's not really that great, is it? I if we can shoot them from there. Right then, well that's our most dangerous unit, we want to sort them out if we can. Um, right, we'll bring you up here. Infantry. Infantry. Oh, you go back here, picked the wrong one, didn't you? General in behind there. And send you up to here. Been very deliberate about this again, as you can see, because I'm trying to keep the casualties down. Got quite a few more battles to fight. Bring you down there. In fact, bring all three of you down here.
That's it, we'll get him around there. Completely surround him and then we'll go and massacre him. down there like so and your general of course this in here, hopefully, hopefully things. There he goes. Let us hope it is not poison to carry in birds. Destroy them! Infantry! Harwin! Infantry! Move out! Waiting for orders! There you go, boys. General, but I'm around. Where have they got left? Twenty three. You're warmed up. Left and one left, maybe. There you go. Be praised. This victory is surely their work, not that of mortals like us. Let's have a look at the casualties now. 165, Craker. <laughs> Still quite a lot, considering. But I mean, that little depleted unit of Duryoferoy, it's only 18 in it. But they fight more like there's 80 in it, you know, and that, that's just the benefit of that, um, the, the bonus they get when they're fighting up in the walls. Um, we've got 27 that have been healed, so, you know, just over 130, not too bad.
Okay, well, I'm going to exterminate because I want the money. Don't really need to, it was safe enough to just occupy, but we'll take the money that's gone now. And um, what we'll do now is we'll get Alexander's army across here to attack these Athenians that are besieging Corinth. But what we'll do first is we'll send an army over, send Selikos over with his army to besiege Athens. And then as long as if we break this army and they try to withdraw or if they withdraw their route, whatever, they can't get back in that settlement because we've blocked them. Right then, uh, make sure public orders are okay there. We'll take a couple of units out of the uh, Jav, the Jav Cav. Um, let's leave a good enough garrison in here. Take the, that unit of Hotwatties and Jab Carve as well, I think. We'll have these three units of the Riofaroi. We'll take all the archers and Uzanoi. Really good, strong army. Now, I think we should be able to bring the two units of Jav Cav out. And public order should be alright. There we go. Sorted. Right. Let's go and deal with this lot. Oh, can't reach them. Ha! Damn you. Alright, never mind. End turn that is. Yeah. We'll get taxes on here, yeah, that's okay, it's fine. I think we could build something in there actually. Uh, something that will bring us money, how about port? Or roads? Yeah, let's go with the roads. Uh, Tanagra. Building an Agora in there. That'll do us for now. And we'll move on to the end turn. I'll need to have a word with the devs and see if we can do something with a script that can stop these spy get into your, one of your settlements about a hundred times. <laughs> right then, uh, how are we here? Okay. So we can probably take this army out. No, I won't bother. Let's go and get this battle done after we have a quick look at the news. Right, we know about that. Agent found or they are down Phoenix, yeah, we know. Recruitment, roads built, there we are. Still in deficit, but we shouldn't be in deficit for much longer. Oh, this Spartan army, a lot of it's come out of uh, Sparta. I don't think they're coming to attack us though. Right, let's deal with this lot. Uh, right then. I've got a lot of depleted units there, some decent units as well. And uh, to get a mixture of experience and upgrades, some haven't got anything. Looks like they've recruited some more troops here, doesn't it? Where'd they get these from? Sure, they only had this many here. About half a stack. Now they've got nearly three quarters of a stack. 
Alright, must be a script spam. Uh, of course, we've got our boys in here. Come and join in as well. So, let's go for it. gathering and it would be ill-mannered to keep them waiting they seem so eager to face their lines so eager to mm, get themselves. a little bit brighter that's a little bit better right then we don't need any more speech from uh, Alexander all right nice flat terrain out in front here And yeah, you'll do there. Let's have Cav over here. Archers, take more fire at will. Set them in there for now. Our general here. Okay. God be praised. The reinforcements are here. Send them to fight. Dishearten the enemy. Well, let's speed things up. We'll get our reinforcements over. It's going to be useful. Just move you up there, get everything in order how I like it. Pretty basic tactic, just go for them. a couple. That's better. to the front there. Yeah. 
shred it. Come on. Let's get our archers back here. Some reason he didn't run back. Come on, guys, get back here. Bring you back here, boys. Mr. Ferrari. General get in and get one of their generals and get two generals, haven't they? Get these guys over there. Set you up there from there. How did their general get around the back there? Out of the way? We run right into his hot with his there. Let's get him. Rally call. Let's kill him off. And general, kill him. Just sitting there getting short to shreds. The spirit of his army is a broken tool. Great God be praised. The enemy general is killed. Fear makes a home in our enemy's heart. Get out of here. Shoot them to the off right. Right, General, let's get you up here. You deal with them. You keep shooting them. You deal with them as well. There's my general. Get you up here, and that's their other general there, I think.
kick carry down. Let's get in here. Get in here. Recruit them as well. Where's that other general going? There he's there. Let's see if we can kill him. Right, let them go. You get up there now. You get up here. Get my general across, I think. They're going to break now. That's good. Warmed up, warmed up. Over here, over here, you over there. Here he comes, here comes your general, he's getting out now. It's a casualty count like 16%, that's not too bad I suppose. And we've got this one. Take care of them. Have you killed that other general? Yep. I'm doing nicely, get my general up here. Shaking, but they're pursuing. Alright, you go get them instead, and you get up here. Take care of them. Shoot them. They're broken now, that's good. Let's get you over here. You up there. They're broken now. And that's it. Battles won. 19% we've lost. Where's my general? Don't get them general. He can finish them off. escaped. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. Dry throat. There's <coughs> 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 a general. There 
he comes. And I think that will do us. God be praised! This victory is surely their work, not that of mortals like us. Crikey, catch what we do. <laughs> But, like I've said many times before, and it's the nature of this mod, you will take a lot of casualties in battles. So I expect it. So what have we got? 11, 12, 25, 26, 34, 44, 46, 53, 59, 70 returned. 350 odd, nearly 360. Well, we just need to get them retrained. Right then, so we could probably take all these settlements here now and leave Selikos to take um, Athens, which should be done over there. Uh, right then, we'll leave all that for the next couple of episodes. I'll oh, thank you very much for watching and um, hope to see you back in the next episode in a few days. Cheers now.